Hi, everybody. I guess she can probably hear that plane going over. <laughs> I can't. I can either do this or the hearing aid up. So, uh. As an artist, do you ever have those times where you feel like you've got a lot of, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of creative energy and then you just kind of crash? And I guess I've been feeling that, and I'm trying to force myself to feel this creative energy. The more I force myself, the more I actually feel, I don't know, kind of weird and gross about myself. I start feeling like I'm really old and icky and disgusting, besides these strange bug glasses I have on. But yeah, I've gone through one of those times where I just, I don't feel confident about myself at all. I feel really guilty. I guess because I spend so much time with my creative energy, I don't give time to the dogs or my husband or nature or really even myself. It's like something else has taken a hold of me and is dragging me around and exhausting me. Like I'm not really taking time for myself just to get a good night's sleep. But the weird thing is, you know, coming off of all this, that I actually feel really disgusting, like I'm a, a whore or a slut or something. <laughs> I know that sounds weird, but can we move? So we're sitting out here outside, um, trying to get a little bit of sun for as long as I can. Oh, he's got a stick, good boy. He's rolling in poop too, but I can understand if I was rolling in poop why I'd feel disgusting, but... <laughs> I can understand why after, or I know I got to talk louder because there's not a good speaker on this. They've been whispering and here I am hearing impaired, almost completely deaf. But I, I just find it really strange that after creativeness, you know, there's that. It's not just a down. I guess it might be, you know, just a down. You go up and then come down and then depending on whatever your down is, that's what you feel. And since I've had a lot of things happen in my childhood, like um, being molested and things, and I don't want to do TMI here, but I guess that I feel kind of gross and icky and guilty because I'm not giving enough of myself to other people. When I, when I give something to myself, I feel guilty. When I want to have a creative moment and do creative things, you know, um, so I kind of stopped writing stories and writing in my blog. And then I started doing a lot of filming, as you know, more like um, um, metaphors and analogies, you know, out, out, art blogs, got so big in my eye. Um, and then I've kind of just done these off the Android. But, and now I'm feeling really, really guilty about having anything for myself and wanting to do any tattoos and piercing and I don't know, I don't know what gives. It's just, um, it's a weird feeling. I hope it goes away. I try to get enough sleep, but I've been like shaking at night. I'll wake up like freaking out, and I don't know why I have these anxiety attacks. So I don't even know if it's part of man manic depressive sort of thing or just something all kind of artists go through. They go through this really high peak of creativeness where you feel like doing everything and you get a lot done and you just have surges of energy with the creativeness and then and then it stops and your body's actually telling you to take this rest take this time to heal again or just have some quiet time and i don't take it because it seems like i'm so far behind because of my hearing loss and my stenosis and things and my illnesses i just feel like i need to catch up with the world and the more I try to catch up, the more behind I become because I have this icky feeling. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure what to do about that, but I'm trying to work through it right now. I'm being really interesting to hear. Come here, Marv. Interesting to hear if anybody else has that. Uh, a couple of people I've watched on blog kind of said that, it made me feel a little relieved. I don't know if they quite get to the point where they feel absolutely disgusted about themselves. <laughs> Like I do, but yeah. Murphy, come on. Hey, I gotta go check on him. I never know what he's eating. <laughs> so that's up, what's up with me today. And I'm getting some weird things on my Android. Did you hear that beep? You probably could hear that beep. So, and it's real annoying on the video. <laughs>
So I gotta go check out and see what that was. I gotta find a way to turn it off. Yeah, because when the phone rings, it rings through here too. So anyway. Anyway, guys, thank you for putting up with me. And today I'm just wearing my cool bar stuff, which is a sun protective stuff. Uh, that way I can be out in the sun a little bit longer. Uh uh. Nothing special, just a lot of beauty around here. So. Love you.